it's an, a, a no-brainer. Like team unity is a requirement at this level of racing. Um, you can maybe try and just be on your own mission, but you're not going to last in the sport or even on the team if that's your main goal. So as a team, we have a unified goal for the overall race season, but each race and even breaking down the race, there's always a goal that everyone has to be aligned on. In cycling, it is a team sport. Like you do need your teammates to support you to get a result if you're the one elected that day for the result. Because on another day, you might then need to help your teammate who's been elected for the result. Yeah. And we have a lot of fun, I think, um, on and off the bike. Certainly, we're, we have dance parties in our house and there's a bit of fun competition. I, Alison and I like to race to random street signs occasionally. Oh, really? <laughs> um, Sprinters. Who, who can walk up the stairs the fastest, those kind of things. Usually it's Alison. But um, yeah, so it's, it's really fun and I think you wouldn't want to be on the team if it wasn't an enjoyable um, environment. So that's why I'm back for a second year for sure. <laughs> and I think what's so powerful about our team this year, we may have a couple of new riders, but a lot of us are returnees. And I think it's because we believe in each other. We want really good things for everyone. We see that, um, yeah, we're committed to that one goal. And I think what's really special about cycling, yeah, there is one winner, mm -hmm. but you have to have that team. And when you have a team that is really buys in to winning together, um, when it is your teammate that wins, you feel it too. Absolutely. Yeah. And, it, and when you have a leader who is going to win the race, who get, really shares that back, even if it's in commentary, you know, appreciating what, or helping even people watching what your teammates did and, and helping even people understand how cycling works and that you need your teammates. And when we did a race in Australia where it was actually a team points competition. And so it was a, whoever, whatever team had gotten the most points out of these sprint marks um, was the winner and the whole team got to go on the podium. Oh, that's nice. And I think it, it was just a good way to exemplify that, hey, it was actually a team that did this. It might've been one rider collecting all the points, but it was the team that won. And I think that that's what cycling is. Yeah, for me, it was also a reason to go to Team Tipco Silicon Valley Bank, that it really is a team, like that the girls are riding together, that you want to yeah, sacrifice uh, for each other, mm -hmm. that you're really also um, uh, riding aggressively. So not only following the attacks or waiting or hesitating, no, they just go for it, they make the move, they make the race. And I think that's really something I want to contribute on next year. Good to have you come to all the good, <laughs> come to all the good coffee shops with us. That's a strong team bonding exercise. Oh well, every, really every new coffee, town. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah.